Hello and welcome back to SSND Productions playthrough of Pokemon Emerald. Now to start things off, I'd just like to say sorry there hasn't been a part for a couple days. I've actually been having recording errors where the VVA emulator actually was like crashing on me and I was losing footage, so I've sorted it all out. Um, I've got enough parts uploaded now for a couple weeks, so, well, up parts recorded now for a couple weeks, so. Hopefully I can get this uh, Let's Play done by uh, sometime at the end of this, maybe the end of the month, maybe. At the most I want to at least go up to February with this. So now we're here fight battling the uh, camera crew again, and these guys are running a current. I'll try to battle them every time I see them. Um, I might not every time though. I mean they're always the same two Pokemon and I'm very high powered anyways so yeah. And their Pokemon do evolve too which is interesting because I think the first time we saw that that Loudred was a Wishmer, I believe. And eventually I believe that Magnemite will be a Magneton. Okay, so now they want us to give another quote. Sure, let's do this again. I always pick a random word whenever I do these. Sometimes I try to make it makes. Sometimes I try to make it uh, make sense. Sometimes I don't. <laughs> like lacking would have been a good one for this fight because this fight was pretty dull. Um, I think I went with sad because that fight wasn't that <laughs> interesting. It was kind of sad to be honest. And they'll be gone next time we come back. Goddamn fishermen. Tentacle. Yeah, so our next destination we, we want to get to is, um... We we're heading up to Fortree City because we want to take on the uh, next gym leader. So that'll be where we'll be heading next. <sighs> I hate these things just because they have um, touch damage essentially. Where you hit them and you'll get some of your HP taken away from just because they have a special ability that does that. It's kind of annoying. Thank God it doesn't affect that much. And it's Steven again. Yep. And he's just explaining where we last saw him. Foreshadowing? Perhaps? <laughs> well, anyways, I can take the shortcut up here. So I'll do that. And my friend Birdbug13, he actually made a comment on my last video claiming that Aragon sounds like a train. And uh, now that I think about it, it does. <laughs> I 
I really am not that good at getting past these guys. I always seem to get caught. I like it when they just have one Pokemon, but two's not bad either. And it's a Taylo. Surprised he still has a Taylo by now. Oh, he does have one. <laughs> it's just... He has one and he has a, a, a younger one, I guess? This is a uh, tall grass. Essentially, all it—it's just regular grass, but you can't run through it and you can't ride your bike. Which I just realized now. I actually have yet to show off the bike. I'll have to get to that later on. Now some of those battle themes are actually pretty interesting to listen to full on, but most people end up skipping them. Ooh, I, 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 I'm not sure if this is the first introduction to the Pokemon Rangers, which would become its own game later on. Either that or it's just a coincidence that they have the same name. Either with that, either way though. And I hate poison powder. Because it does that. Yes, I do have a Pokemon. I've never turned it on before. Minus that one time I was, I was forced to. And as always, when you get poisoned, the screen will flicker like that just to show that your Pokemon is still being injured by the poison. So it's best to heal them before they die. Especially if it's your signature Pokemon, because you don't want to lose that while you're out here. I think this is actually where my recorder messed up the first time. Well, not the recorder, but I think this is where the emulator messed up. Where right around when I ended the save file for this part, it crashed and I lost all the save data, so I had to start over. Which is really annoying. Thank God I managed to get back up. Oop, and it's Team Aqua again. Must be up to something. And not to go into the Weather Institute, because that's where I'm going next. See you guys next part.